Hey everybody, welcome to Why Buy. Today, let's talk about the McBride Bomber Jacket. It gets pretty cold here in Alberta, so I needed a jacket that could keep up. And when I was looking around, um, I didn't really see, for one, anything style-wise that I liked. What I kept finding was, you know, if there was a warm jacket that was downfilled, it had that kind of poof roll to it. I don't know what to call the design of it, but uh, it's just, it's Michelin Man versus, you know, flat pile kind of thing. I walked into Sport Check one day and I'm looking at all the winter jackets and I saw those Canada Goose ones and they're pretty expensive. I mean, like I didn't see the, the true value there. Uh, and then I saw the Woods jacket just down the way and I looked at the price tag, it was about half the price. Actually, less than half the price. When you compare the two, you wonder, you know, why there's such a price gap. And it could just be branding. I think I had a set of lawn chairs that were made from woods and I didn't know that they, they made such high quality jackets. It's just, it's the little details of this jacket that I really like. But um, just for example, like on the front, you have this kind of waterproof splash guard near your crotch. But on the back side of it, you know, if you're sitting down and the jacket, jacket's, uh, the jacket's zipped up, the back portion of it actually has uh, this elastic right around, along the So it's, uh, it's comfortable. Like it's really comfortable to wear every day. One thing that I really like about this, the buttons and the zipper, super sturdy. When you're reefing on this thing constantly, I don't care if the jacket has a lifetime warranty or not. When you have to take it to the store after a year just to get the zipper replaced, it's an inconvenience you don't want. One thing that is really important, no Velcro. When you fall in the snow or something like that and it gets all gunked up, it's pretty much useless and it's abrasive on your skin. And when it's cold out, and your skin's cold and you hit something like Velcro, it feels like a cheese grater. When I'm out filming and you know we're outside in the winter, mobility wise, wearing something like this, not only was it stylish, but it was practical as well. You know, it was a very well insulated jacket that I can move around still with. And this was definitely something that for everyday use, yeah, highly recommend it. So if you thought this video was helpful, please like and subscribe, show your support and thanks for watching. I'm just, I'm gonna read through some of the uh, features as per Woods. Uh, you'll understand this, everybody. So I can't, this is ridiculous. Canatite active technology, you remember that. 700 fill power down tech, duck down. Provides ultimate warmth without extra bulk. Actually, I could reword that. You really feel the 700 fill power down tech, duck down. <laughs> <laughs> you can swipe to the left, there's like maybe other Whatever. stuff, but it's all... <laughs> Removable North American sourced ki Canadian coyote fur trim. Wah! <laughs> Looking for more opinions like this? Then hit the subscribe and bell button. Want to get paid to make your own videos? Visit ybyglb.com. Become a member. Now you can start sharing knowledge on the things that you love. Just film some clips, we review them, put them together, and that's it. Oh. You also get paid for each video we publish. It's that simple.